Hi and welcome, thank you for joining me. We are going to take a look at the exercises and the scales for Trinity's Grade 2 exam for 2021 to 2023. You will probably know that for the exercises you need to learn either A or B for each number and in the exam itself you'll play just two. You choose one, the examiner will choose the other. For the scales you need to learn them all by heart and the examiner will choose a selection. We're going to start with the exercises, then the scales. Let's go. 1A exercise, smooth operation, 94 beats per minute. One B, a crisp winter morning. Two A, striding out. To be marching orders. <clears throat> Three A rumble strips. And finally, 3B, feeding the llamas. Now let's take a look at the scales and the arpeggios. The scales, we have to be able to play them two octaves, hands together, legato, and both forte or piano. And the tempo is 80 beats per minute. Okay. B flat major, start with the third finger in the left hand and the third finger in the right hand. for really even sound. Right hand does start with third finger generally, but you'll have noticed that once the scale gets going, it's actually the fourth finger is the official finger for the B flat, but it would be a bit silly to start with the fourth. Why make it that difficult? Hence the third finger at the start. Its relative minor would be G minor. Now we're going to do both the harmonic and the melodic here, but for the exam, you just need to choose one or the other. G, harmonic minor, first of all. G, melodic minor. What we're going to do is I'll start off being a very minor sounding scale. And then at the top end, borrow the top half from G major, but 
when we come down, we play with the E flat and the B flat that are in the key signature. Here we go. D major, two sharps. And its relative minor is B minor. Left hand will start with the fourth finger. Let's do harmonic first of all. find that bit there is tricky. We've got funny gaps between our fingers. Hop around, can you play that bit? And the melodic minor. Chromatic scale in similar motion, starting on B flat, third fingers. And we're always aiming for a nice even sound, no lumpiness, nice and smooth. C major, contrary motion. Um, I'll deliberately do, do this one quietly. Nice curved fingers all the time, especially for this scale work that we're doing. Arpeggios, there are only four. Hands separately, two octaves, legato, mezzo forte, and the speed is 60 beats per minute. Nice and steady, give us an opportunity to find the notes. B flat major. Just like the scale, the official finger for the B flat, I say official, is the fourth finger, but it would be a bit silly to start with the fourth finger. So start with something that makes it comfortable. And thereafter, one, two, four is the fingering. Um, let's stick with the right hand. Let's go through all the right hand ones. D major. fluid elbow. You might have to just push your elbow out a bit to help, especially for coming down. G minor. sound. And let's go through the left hand as well. B flat major. Three, two, one. D major. Incidentally, it doesn't really matter where you start. Don't get hung up about, oh, have I started in the right octave? There's no such thing. As long as you play it smoothly, um, it will be fine. Um, and start somewhere so that it's comfortable. I did D there, I could have started down there. A G minor. And finally, B minor. You have a choice here. I've got big hands, so I'm going to choose fourth finger on that. If you've got a slightly smaller hand, you will probably prefer the third. Mm -hmm. 
I hope you found that run through helpful. Any questions, do get back to me and good luck with all your music practice. Bye bye for now.